Good morning, y'all. Nathan Christ here, owner of Daisy Dukes Landscaping, located just outside of Charlotte, North Carolina. And today I'm going to give you a little tip that we pros use when we go to pick up limbs, when we go to cut ornamental grasses, things like that that make it a whole lot easier. The only thing you're going to need to make this happen is some type of rope or a piece of twine. Personally, I use a, a baler twine and nylon rope, but you can use any type of twine that you don't want to keep, something that you want to throw away, but something that's sturdy enough that it's not going to break when you pick it up. Now all you're going to do is lay down your string in kind of a makeshift A pattern. And then all you need to do is take your limbs, take your sticks, and it's easier if you keep all the cut pieces going in the same direction and just lay them directly across the center of the string. Now the size of the string is going to depend on how many sticks that you're wanting to pick up. Next, all you need to do is find your two loose pieces, wrap it over the top of your bundle, find your, find your uh, loop side and just tuck it under. Put both of them underneath and cinch it down. And what's gonna happen is the tighter you pull, the tighter the string is gonna get. And what I'll do is if this is a big bundle and I've got a lot of extra rope, I'll keep wrapping it down and under, down and under, down and under. Now what you're gonna be left with is a nice bundle with a handle that you can easily pick up, throw on the trailer, take it to the burn pile, whatever you're gonna do with it to dispose of it. And it's quick, it's easy, you don't have to pull out a tarp, you don't have to worry about damaging a tarp, dragging it across the ground. And it's just, it's time saving and it's just one of the tips that we pros use day in and day out. One last thing that I did want to mention. I would do the exact same thing if this was ornamental grasses or something that was growing upright and bending over with the foliage. I would bring it up at the bottom. I would cinch the rope around the middle and then I would just wrap it. And I would keep wrapping it all the way around the top till I got all those little pieces of foliage or that stuff all bent up into a nice little bundle. And then what I would do is I would cut the bottom of it. I would cut the bottom of the, the grass in this case. And again, I would have a nice bundle that I can easily throw in the trailer or dispose of. So guys, I appreciate you watching. Again, this is Nathan Chris with Daisy Dukes Landscaping. If you're not following us on Facebook, find us on Facebook. Give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to us on YouTube, and you'll be the first to know about our tips, tricks, and do-it-yourself projects. It's going to save you time and money. Guys, we appreciate you. We love you. God bless.